About 2,000 people at the Curlew Hills Memory Garden Sunday morning. Honoring the thousands of lives lost on September 11th, 2001. They say never forget, but memories fade and as time passes, it's easy to get lost in all these other things that we have going on in our daily lives. And so I think it's really important that we're taking time here 21 years uh, after one of the worst attacks this country has ever faced uh, to remember, to remember the lives that we lost, almost 3,000. Governor Ron DeSantis was a special guest at the ceremony, addressing the crowd who came together for a common purpose, to commemorate the victims of 9-11. It's also important to remember the bravery that we saw that day, uh, both from our first responders uh, as well as just run-of-the-mill civilians who happened to be put into a very difficult situation. And I think it's especially important so that some of the young people in our community who maybe weren't even alive then or maybe were very young understand what that day meant to this country. Other guest speakers emphasized the importance of keeping the memory alive so those who were born after 2001 still understood the attack significance in our nation's history and to ensure that something like it never happens again. Our whole purpose of this service and this service like this every year is to never forget what occurred that day for the people that lost loved ones, but more importantly, for us as a country. Because if we forget it, it'll happen again. We'll go to sleep. And one morning we'll wake up again and we'll see that on our TVs again. The 9-11 Memorial stood next to where the service was held. A morning of grief, but also of solidarity and patriotism. Reporting in Palm Harbor, Justin Matthews, Fox 13 News. <laughs>